hi so this is tactic um, tactic is basically an insight management platform using which companies can basically um, connect our platform with their websites their apps and um, our platform will automatically um, in, uh, input all the user reviews that it will fetch from the internet um, from Google Play Store or all the links and the review files that a particular company uh, inputs for their app or website so over here um, each company would assign uh, a company admin to register for uh, on a platform and once a company admin has signed up um, they'll be able to create uh, product managers um, uh, so this is how it works this is basically the um, company admin dashboard and over here they can add product managers that will uh, be they can be multiple product managers for a particular product so now I'm gonna log out and sign in as a product manager this is a sample for a fresh mart that is basically an e-commerce platform a sample e-commerce platform that i've created specifically for this project so over here um, uh, our platform has basically fetched all the user reviews that were posted on google play store and using nlp that is neural language processing we have a kind of you know um, take it out taken out review tags certain tags that are prevalent in um, most of the reviews so so for example uh, if there are multiple reviews that are uh, mentioning poor connectivity or good ux uh, our platform will uh, create custom tags that uh, that go by the name poor connectivity or maybe um, good ui that uh, you can see over here so um, home page on the home page basically you can uh, there's a graph uh, which you can see um, and um, this particular button for show app updates this basically allows the comp uh, product managers to kind of um, know that uh, there were uh, there was a fall in positive uh, user feedback after a certain update so that kind of indicates that there were some bugs introduced into the app or website uh, after this particular update was pushed and similarly you can see over here that um, there has been an increase in the number of negative user reviews after this particular update so this kind of makes it easier for the developers to kind of know what changes were made in this particular update that that introduced new new issues so then uh, over here we can see that there are uh, there is a list of all the positive review tags as well as negative review tags that our system our, uh, our platform has basically uh, generated using nlp um, now i'm gonna just click over here to view the details of a particular tag um, right here we can see that there has been a slight increase in the number of reviews that uh, that uh, mention poor connectivity over a period of uh, one month so this kind of shows that um, there was once an update pushed or they, there has uh, a change in a change taken place that has um, resulted in this issue over here um, this kind of shows that all right this is a very severe issue and how is this calculated this is basically calculated uh, this basically depends on how many uh, feedbacks have mentioned poor connectivity how many detailed reviews have been there that mention poor connectivity um, by detailed reviews i mean for example if there has been a review that just says that this app has poor connectivity so that's not quite helpful however if there is an, another review on the internet that uh, perfectly explains uh, the poor connectivity issue like uh, how the when does this uh, issue exactly happen so that kind of makes it easier for the developers to recreate this issue and fix it 
so this is how we kind of scale uh, put it uh, give it a rating on our severity scale so this is a severity this is a, this is rated 9 on a severity scale that means it is a very um, severe issue and it needs to be fixed uh, fixed as soon as possible so recommended actions over here we can basically connect this system to jira or trello which is a product management um, software so once we connect it to Jira or Trello, we can directly share all these details uh, on this uh, these uh, this uh, up uh, uptrend in the usage of poor connective uh, poor connectivity and an entire list of uh, all the reviews that mention poor connectivity, especially the ones that are more credible, like I'm, like I mentioned earlier. So this uh, all of this kind of makes it easier for the developers to uh, resolve the issues uh, at the earliest. Similarly, over here we can see that um, here's a sample page for positive review that um, that just says that this particular app or website has a good interface. So over here, uh, the um, product manager can also upload uh, user data, uh, user review data. So for example, if if um, the app or the website collects user review um, separately and it does not actually upload it directly to any servers or anywhere so uh, the company or the product uh, the product managers can like uh, generate an excel sheet or a csv file and then upload it to our platform and our platforms will then again uh, perform the same steps and they'll go through the entire sheet they'll they'll create a tags using nlp and that's that's when uh, this this particular list of 3072 positive reviews and 981 negative review tags will get updated with new tags that would that this system will fetch from this user review excel sheet now what is this product update data uh, excel sheet so uh, like i mentioned very uh, earlier um, over here that we have show app updates so the company can also upload an excel sheet that has the data of when uh, the updates were pushed and what was the version of a uh, version of the update that was pushed so all of it just kind of makes everything easier for the developers as well as product managers over here we can connect um, our platform with Jira or Trello to again make make things easier to share between different uh, between uh, different teams. So, for example, um, if we have a negative review tag for <clears throat> for poor connectivity, so we can directly share using this button with the team that is kind of responsible for fi uh, for fixing this issue. If we have display problems or app crashing problems, or say for example unavailable pin code, so uh, we can easily share all these details with the respective teams. And then the last one is import data, export data. I'm sorry. So we can just export all these data, all this data, all the tags and all the reviews attached with particular tag to help make things easier for everyone. So this is how it actually works. And um, yeah, I mean, this is basically it.